Hey guys and welcome back to a brand new video. Now in today's video we're going to be making custom titles for players in Roblox Studio. If you guys like this video please leave a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel and without further ado let's get into it. Okay so the first thing you guys want to do is go ahead to the description below and download the custom titles model. Now I made this earlier, all it is is it's just a billboard GUI. This doesn't involve any scripts because we're going to script it right now. And don't even think about skipping to the end of the video just to grab the script real quick. I know what you guys are like, don't do it, watch the full video. Yeah, go ahead and download this and insert it into the game. Now what you want to do is you want to move rank into replicate storage. Just go ahead and delete this nonsense, I don't even know why it's here. Now what you want to do is go into server script service, insert script. And we're going to name this player titles. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to speed this part of the video up because I'm so nice and kind. Now, if you guys do actually want me to explain this code, explain what it does, drop that in the comments below and I won't speed these parts of the videos up. But for this tutorial, I'm just going to speed this part up and follow along. And without further ado, let's start. Okay, and there we go. Now, if we just go ahead and give this a quick test, it should work. So how this works is we have a table up here. Your user ID goes in here. The title, like the rank name will go in here and the color of the rank will go in here. So for example, I'm a YouTuber and I want it to be purple. So we just change the color here. If we test this, there we go. Anonymous dev YouTuber. Now, if we just click stop, if we just remove ourselves from here, we can just do 0000. zero, zero, zero. It shouldn't show our tag. Okay, and there you go, it seems to work. Now, let's just give this one more test. If we make this developer, and we can change the color to blue. Give this a quick test, and there we go. If we also reset our character, this should reappear and awesome there you go now that will do for today's tutorial that's how you make custom player tags in roblox studio if you guys like this video please make sure to leave a like subscribe and i'll see you in the next one bye